Hey guys, it's Sue. Welcome back to my fake life. Today I am building a family home in Willow Creek. I know, shocking, right? Um, however, this is actually a very big family home. It is four bedrooms, three bathrooms. Every room is very spacious. The upstairs bathroom has a laundry room in it. Um, before we get into anything else, if you can go ahead and hit that like button below, it just helps my content get out to other people who enjoy The Sims, and I like to feed that algorithm. So anyways, back to the build. Um, the third floor on this is not real. It's a fake third floor. Even without it though, this build is seriously gigantic. It's got a nice big kitchen, and a nice big dining room living room is big one bedroom on the bottom floor which usually I tend to make the toddler room but I actually made the master bedroom on the bottom floor the top floor I would say that there's a toddler room there's like a teens room and then there are twin girls and twin boy room so a lot of people can actually live in this house uh, if you have a big family it is also, I mean, you could turn one of the rooms into an office or something like that, but I feel like it actually could be a good 100 baby challenge house. So I just recently did a build with the same exact color scheme, the red brick with the white and the dark roof. I didn't even realize it until after I came, I left, I did it, I came back later on and I'm like, wait a second, I just did this exact same color scheme. However, I kept it because I just really, really, really like the way it looks. So yeah, it is similar to another one I did recently, but eh, oh well, it happens. It kind of reminded me of like a farmhouse or something like that. And so I was like trying to debate what I should call it. And I didn't know nothing like that was um, unique was coming to me for a name of this house. So you're going to laugh at the name of the house. The house is called A House. <laughs> That's what I named this one, A House. I was like, you know what? It is both not at all um, unique or like whatever, but it is also like really original because who names their builds a house? Yeah, I did. I just could not think of a name and I didn't want to make it be, I was like, should I name like family farmhouse or something? But I've already done all that. So it's called a house and using debug items to do um, the landscaping there, I cut a lot of that out because it gets boring. Um, I spent a lot of time trying to get them perfectly round and perfect so that none of them were out of place because I know that when you think, I like, I will do this, like one will just be slightly out of place and I'll be like, oh, you won't notice once the landscaping gets in there, but then that's like all I can see. So I spent a lot of time trying to get those little blocks to be straight. So moving on to the inside, I was kind of getting bored with all of the floors that we have. So I decided to make my own floor um, on the bottom floor. So the bottom floor has this like floor that I made. Um, upstairs, I just do like a light wood. I don't typically change the floor from upstairs to downstairs, but I just didn't want to carry this floor into the upstairs. Um, I really like how everything came out. This kitchen and dining area is just perfect. I just love it. I love the big window. I originally was going to have the kitchen on the other side, but I wanted that big window to be where the, um, the dining room table was. So that's what I did. Um, and this build, you guys, it took me so long. Um, the, for some reason, the bottom floor flew by, like I did that really quick, but the top floor, um, I don't know. Bedrooms just aren't my strong suit. And I had to do a lot of bedrooms. Is it five bedrooms? All of a sudden I'm like thinking, so there's upstairs, there's the teen room. And there's the toddler room. You know, this is actually five bedrooms. It's five bedrooms, three bathrooms. I have it listed as four bedrooms, three bathrooms on the gallery, but it's not. It's five, actually. I just realized that. So, yeah, this is a really big house, but it doesn't look that big. And I kind of like that. Big houses just don't really look that great in The Sims. So when a house doesn't necessarily look big, but it is very spacious, that's always kind of a bonus. I don't really have much else to say right now, but I am going to watch along if I have anything that I want to pipe in and say. I will. Otherwise, I will see you guys in the next one.